We all have our own unique stories, but there is something special about the moment when our stories merge and our energy is united. In these moments, we find our inspiration and purpose, knowing that we've empowered you to shine. Energy United, every day empowered. I'm John Galena, combat wounded veteran. I served in Iraq in 2004, and I live here in Statesville, North Carolina with my wife, Corey Ann, and our three kids. Uh, myself and my battle buddy, Del Beatty, started Purple Heart Homes in 2008 after returning home and getting a great welcome home from our community. I'd have to say the greatest source of inspiration for me joining the military was really my grandfather and a lot of the older veterans that I met growing up that, you know, just loved their country and just wanted to give back. And so in high school, you know, I realized that I had a lot to be thankful for and, and I too wanted to give back. Uh, returning home after being in Iraq, you know, really the, the light bulb went off seeing all the older veterans that were thanking us for our service and the community and the outpouring of support thanking us for our service and realizing that there were so many older veterans that had never been thanked, had never been welcomed home, and they had such a significant need. And we just knew that there had to be something that we could do to pay it forward, to give them that freedom of choice and a little bit of peace of mind to live out their best lives. We invest in veterans through our programs of the Veterans Aging in Place uh, program that we operate, helping to provide wheelchair ramps, handicap accessible bathrooms, uh, new heating systems, and replacing roofs for veterans so that they don't have to have mold in their homes. But beyond that, our newest program provides tiny homes an opportunity for homeless veterans and veterans that may be living in substandard housing to have adequate, safe, accessible homes that they can live out their lives in. Uh, affordability is a big factor in housing right now for every single one of us. But the opportunity to be able to invest into a veteran's life, to be able to allow them that little bit of peace of mind and freedom of choice is invaluable. And so we encourage folks to get involved, not only to simply thank a veteran, but to ask a veteran about their service, to listen to the stories about their service, and then to get involved, whether it's to volunteer or to donate to any type of veterans housing organization so that you can know that you are paying back, you are thanking them for their service and their sacrifice to let them know that they've not been forgotten.